millions of women, children, and men have never known peace in their lives. They wake up each morning to the fear of war, oppression, or persecution for demanding the basic civil rights we take for granted. Thanks to your help, the Carter Center is working to change this. Most recently, we observed democratic elections in Nepal, Madagascar, Kenya, Sierra Leone, and Libya. We strengthened the justice system in post-conflict Liberia and advanced reform in the mining sector in the Democratic Republic of Congo. We continued to push for alternatives to war in Syria and in Israel and Palestine. We advanced people's fundamental right to information and improved the transparency of governments in Latin America and Africa. We fostered dialogue for a lasting peace between Sudan and South Sudan, and with President Carter's deep commitment and energy. I'm very proud of those of you who are heroes in your own country. We strengthened the voices of human rights defenders across the world. When we go in the field, people trust us. We're not only built on President Carter's reputation, but also the integrity that we've continued to bring and build over these many years. And where we go, other people often aren't. We don't duplicate effort. But what we do do is bring different groups together in order to have them work together to make their countries better. And the reality is, we can't do what we do without our donors. And every time I'm able to do something to make a difference, even a small difference in people's lives, I recognize that that's because of the donations that people give and the trust that they've provided in us. To continue our mission of peace in the world, the Carter Center needs your support now. Please make a gift and bring others the promise of hope, the promise of a life free from conflict and fear. The path to peace starts with you.